The ZTEC MIS 21C has many different features for conducting NDT inspections. Today we are going to focus on conductivity testing. The calibration wizard and intuitive interface makes the MIS 21C easy to use for conductivity measurements. In order to properly calibrate the MIS 21C, an approved conductivity standard is needed in the IACS range of the material to be tested, along with an appropriate sized probe. From the main menu, choose Conductivity and Coating Thickness. This will bring up the template menu. Select an appropriate technique. The current technique will now be shown. In the upper left corner, tap the Calibrate icon. Then use the Tap to Calibrate menu item in the lower right corner to move to the Conductivity Coupon Entry screen. The sample being used in this video has two values to be entered. Tap the Add Delete menu item, then tap Add to enter the first coupon value. We will do this for both coupon values on the standard being used. For this demonstration, a coupon with the IACS in the high 20s and high 50s will be used for calibration. Our test sample has a conductivity that resides between these two conductivity values. The coating thickness will next need to be entered. A shim of 3 mils will be used. Tap Add to enter the coating thickness, then tap Next in the lower right corner. Follow the calibration instructions shown in the lower left corner. With the probe on each coupon, tap Next. An audible beep will be heard upon completion of each step, then follow the next instruction. When calibrating, make certain the probe is flat and in full contact with the standard. Any rocking or liftoff will result in improper calibration. Go through all steps in the calibration process. If for any reason acquisition was stopped, press the Stop Play button to enter acquisition mode. Operation can now be verified using the conductivity standards. If using the conductivity curve, readings without the shim will be on the outer curve and readings with the shim will be on the inside curve. The conductivity and liftoff can also be read directly. Calibration is now complete. A visual representation of the conductivity curve will now be shown. Tap Done in the lower right corner to complete the calibration process. The MIS 21C will now be in acquisition mode. Select a sample to be tested. We will be using a conductivity coupon representing our test object. Most times you will be provided with the conductivity values of the material under test. Knowing the type of material is necessary to get accurate readings. For convenience, typical material IACS specifications can be found on the instrument which will be shown later. Normal operation is the same as testing the standard. Apply the probe completely to the surface of the test specimen to obtain the IACS and coating thickness reading if valid. Compare this reading to the material IACS test specification. To set the alarm, press the Stop Play button if necessary to stop acquisition. Tap the alarm icon. Use the menu items in the lower left of the screen to set your upper and lower limits for both the conductivity IACS and, if desired, coating thickness. Press the Stop Play button to enter acquisition. The alarm will now function according to your setup. Red indications on the screen and an optional audible alarm will notify the user of a triggered alarm. When the probe is in the air, the alarm will not sound. To access the materials list, if in acquisition mode, press the Stop Play button to stop the acquisition. Select the Tools icon in the upper right corner, tap Tools in the lower right corner. Use your finger to slide the menu up and tap Materials List. 
A list of materials is displayed with defined IACS specifications to assist in setup for your specific use. This concludes our video on setting up the ZTEC MIS 21C for conductivity testing. For more information, please contact one of our sales representatives.